Hello everyone, how does one that spent time on welfare as a child grow up to be financially successful enough to be able to splurge on a phone game like Empires and Puzzles and own this beautiful home in the Caribbean? Was it the lottery, an inheritance, an insanely high paying job? No, it was not any of these. It was as simple as learning to become financially fluent and sound through basic principles that anyone can apply. Just like I enjoy sharing knowledge that I have learned while playing Empires and Puzzles, I also enjoy sharing knowledge on becoming financially strong through multiple income streams and smart investments. In addition to my books about Empires and Puzzles, one can also find my book, Build a Million Dollar Net Worth While Achieving Perfect Credit on Amazon. In this book, I detail all the secrets of my financial success. These strategies help me get ahead. Maybe they can help you too. Look for the link in the description below. All right, day four of the Bus Booster Four Star No Holy. Been a perfect week so far, as far as all wins on offense, and it's been a perfect loss on defense. So, defense is in the toilet, offense is doing amazing. Basically, been using two variations of either a nature team or an ice team. So let's see. Uh, how this goes today and this is probably looking to be an ice team No, I won the last four attacks last week, so I'm actually sitting at 19, 19 straight wins in raid tournaments. I'd like to make this number 20, facing Mr. Stephen King. Not hating that board. Are you going to potentially set me up for a diamond? Nope. I kind of wish I would have put Bold Tuscan instead of Melindor at this point. Alright, let's feed the tiles. That was fortunate. <coughs> Let's get some buffs of our own. And see, this is one of the things people should not use Wilbur on defense in these events for the buff booster because they actually gave me buffs. So they're drastically increasing my power. So I'm going to go ahead and hit Colin here with Sonya to remove the buffs. And we'll double up on the Grimms. So, Mr. Stephen King, thank you for that. That made this a whole lot easier. Made my hero a lot stronger. And that is going to be that. Twenty in a row. Okay. It's like people are doing the limit breaking and then they're just using limit broke heroes for their defense as if that'll be the answer to everything. Can't say I agree with that. Now, do we want to move over to green? I think we shall. Let's go back to our green team.
All right, so I might want to switch him in now. I need to be a little smarter about that. <clears throat> Nobody's giving me negative attack. All right. Show me the board. One more shot at giving me a green. You know what? I will take that. I think we can get a freebie on here without using... <coughs> trying to get the free heal without using the diamond quite yet. Green under Grim. No such luck. Pop the diamond now. Alright. Killing pretty good. She's about to go off, so let's... Ah, mana shield. Touche pussycat. All she did was prolonged her inevitable death. Your demise is all but assured. Mm, and he withstood it. So neither of them are really getting affected by Hansel. That bold tusk. I guess that limit break. He just does not want to die. But I shall be victorious. It's just taking a lot longer than I would like. an unfortunate cascade. All right. 21. 31 is my record. Ew. So we got a healing center and two hitters on the end. Man, if I had Zilla, I have three Zilla A's. Zilla A's, excuse me, for hitting people on the end like that, but I don't have emblems on them, so they do not hit nearly as hard as I'd like. So what do we think, folks? Green or blue? Hmm. 
I think I'm going to stick with green. <laughs> oh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. I think sixteen is the most I've seen on a sporting board. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Yeah, I think I'll stick with green. Well, that was a waste that it eliminated everything in one shot like that. I wanted to get a couple hits out of that. Feed her tiles? Well, pop her. Jeez. Green tiles just keep it coming. She evaded. I should have threw that on him. And this board is just giving up green tiles everywhere. 22. 22 straight wins. Sir John Holmes. All right, getting a little more dangerous, only one healer. People that want to fight back. All right, so we're going to flop over to blue. Wish she had a bit more bite. Let's just stick with what's been working. <clears throat> wow. Man. I swear I did not pay anybody off for this. These boards are just delicious. practically playing themselves. Oh, let's go to him. Alright. Put the buffs in. This is really going well. <coughs> The streak continues. Twenty three straight wins. Let's get rid of this one and see what we can do for this last hit. Not that bad considering I started the day fighting Stephen King. It'd be pretty cool if it was actually the Stephen King. All right, let's get this party started. No regard for regard. Let's just get these tiles up. Okay, 23 straight wins. Let's go for 24. And we're not switching anything up. I'm seeing three healers. Now, everybody's doing this three healer center with the people who strike on the sides. I'm not sure I'm convinced that is a thing. 
That's probably a stupid move, but I'm feeling stupid. be in some danger here. Those little pot shots are starting to add up. Oh boy. Well, let's remove the buffs. I got some of my own. <laughs> and that is going to be that. I don't even really care what Grim is doing at this point. My Grim is better than your Grim. That is 24. 